tutorial is designed to show you how to quickly administer WorkPro's qualification checks. So logging into the platform, and you're going to send a request to a candidate, either as a single request or as a bulk request to many candidates. One candidate, entering the candidate's name and their email address, selecting background check, qualification check, and then determining the qualifications that you'd like the candidate to upload, either the highest tertiary qualification or a full tertiary qualification history. Once that's completed, you can then send the request. Once the request has been sent, the candidate will receive an email invitation, which contains a live link and a single use token. If that task remains outstanding, WorkPro will also send email alerts three days apart. So logging out of the platform, I'm quickly going to show you how a candidate completes their application process. The candidate either signs up to WorkPro or logs in with an existing um, username and password. So logging into the platform, the candidate is entering the token which is contained in the email invitation, selecting background check, qualification check, and starting the application process. The candidate will complete personal details, birth and their names, selecting next. They're entering the information, the qualification, the institution, the location, and any dates. Selecting next. They're also uploading a copy of their transcript and also a government issued photo identification. Once that's been completed, the candidate signs electronically. A work pro is available on any device, uh, which means uh, whether, when they're uploading a file, it picks up whether they're on a mobile phone or a, uh, an iPad or a desktop. Once that's been completed, they then submit their application. So once that application has been submitted, you'll receive an email alert inviting you into the dashboard to view the information and then submit the check for processing. So logging back into the platform. Either using the filter to find the candidate or scrolling through your list, selecting background checks, qualification check, selecting your applicant, with the status of please review, which basically means the candidates completed uh, their requirements and this is ready to be checked and validated and processed or submitted for processing. You can see here the qualification that's been completed and the charge that's going to be associated with this particular check. Selecting next, viewing the consent form, viewing the identity document, and then submitting the check for processing. So once that check has been submitted for processing, WorkPro's specialist vetting team will open up that application, check the identity, check that the signature matches, and then submit that check to the institution. Once that's been returned, you'll receive an email invitation letting you know that the check has been finalised, welcoming you into the dashboard to view the um, final result. The final result will be a full disclosure certificate, which is also stored in WorkPro permanently as an audit trail for your organisation. That concludes today's video walkthrough. I will see you next time.